The spiritual world exists all around us, and I want to give you a sense of just how present that world is. I'm not alone in this room. There are at least two angels and two evil spirits with me all the time. And not only that, but my spirit is right now in a community of other spirits in the spiritual world. So I'm effectively surrounded by spirits. So why are there two angels and two evil spirits with us? Swedenborg says, through the evil spirits, we have contact with hell. And through the angels, we have contact with heaven. If we were not in touch with both, we could not possibly survive for a minute. That's because one of those angels is connected to my feelings or my will. And same thing with one of those evil spirits. And there's a thought angel and a thought evil spirit with me all the time. And the goodness that's coming out of those angels and the truth that's coming out of those angels meets up with the evil and the falsity that's coming out of the evil spirits. And where they hit creates equilibrium. And that equilibrium is where my consciousness has to reside in order to be able to exist. The kinds of things those spirits are talking about, the things that they love, the things they're engaging with, that shows up in me as impulses and ideas and epiphanies. So I am absolutely being affected by what's going on around me spiritually. The human form is a miniature version of heaven. So just like my hand is good for manipulating stuff and grabbing things and getting stuff done, there are angels in the grand assemblage of heaven that Swedenborg calls the grand human who are doing the same thing. Spirits and angels in the universal human who correspond to the hands, arms, and shoulders are the ones with power, which they receive through religious truth that springs from goodness. People devoted to this kind of truth have the Lord's power because they attribute all power to him and none to themselves. So there's these powerful angels out doing powerful things in the spiritual world, but my hand has a direct connection to those angels. It's only because of them and all the other angels that make up the totality of the form of the grand human being that I can be in the shape that I am, which is this miniature reflection of God. So that's just some of how much this spiritual world is affecting the physical world and your day-to-day experience right now. And it's important to learn about the spiritual world because it's only through knowing that that we can really make sense of what we go through every day. Hey, so we were just learning about how the spiritual world is all around us. Do you want to learn more? We are doing a three-day conference this summer here on the Bernathan College campus. You can come and hang out with us. We're going to do talks, workshops, and really get to the bottom of what the spiritual side of life is like and how it influences us every day. There's virtual options available as well. If you want to do it, if you want more information on it, click the link below. We'd love to get to meet you.